What's going on YouTube? It's DGen Rips. We got such an exciting and big video. It is the debut edition of Donruss UFC 2022. Been waiting for this. And until I'm making that Pac-Man money, which I'm not, this is high stakes for me because it comes right out of my pocket. <clears throat> so you guys feel it. You guys will feel the tension, the pressure. I feel it, man. I feel it. Three hundred dollar box. You know, I. This this is it, man. This is this is me gambling like a degenerate in front of you guys. Doesn't make it any better that I'm just recording it. It's still gambling. It's still being a total degen. But I'm gonna do it for you guys, for the fans, for myself to quench my addiction. But let's do this first box here or first pack I mean we got some nice uh, base cards here right get these base cards out no we don't want to see the base cards and we got our first rookie Tracy Cortez we got a press proof Anthony Smith press proof Forrest Griffin legend retro series Bisping Craftsman, Masvidal, another Retro Series Bisping. Oh, the, this Retro Series was numbered. This is our first numbered card here to 99, Michael Bisping. The count. You know what? One of my, one of my favorite memories of watching the sport is Michael Bisping knocking out Rockhold. It's also one, it's also one of my favorites is him getting knocked out by Hendo. We got our first Marvels, Shevchenko, Octagon Marvels, really cool. I think I'll have to sleeve that up, give everyone a nice sneak peek, you know, of what that these Marvels look like, Octagon Marvels. We got one of the, the women's goat, in my opinion, Valentina Shevchenko, who got robbed against Amanda Nunes when they fought the second time. And I think these are just base cards to round us off, round us off of this first box. Joe Lozon about to fight the cowboy. Ooh, this one's pretty thick. I think this has got to be the mem card. It does say it comes with a mem card and an autograph. I do feel something thick in here. Stipe, Moreno. Of course, they got to go upside down. Colby Chaos, and then they go back right when I switch it. Mackenzie Dern. Why does she look like an alien here? This is some terrible lighting for my girl Mackenzie Dern, who is otherwise absolutely beautiful. Oh my goodness. We got Francis and Ganu. Octagon loyalty. We got Francis and Ganu. You gotta hope the UFC comes to terms with Francis and Ganu in these contract negotiations. The guy is. On on his way to being the greatest heavyweight of all time, for sure. You know, maybe another defense or two. I think you gotta you gotta put him up there. But um, until then, it looks like the UFC and him. That's a nice Alex Morano there. But yeah, here we go. Press proof. Until they come to terms, it's looking like he's really holding out. We got a press proof Chuck Liddell purple. Is this one numbered? I guess. It is not, but it is purple for some reason. Press proof. And we got our first crunch time insert of Khabib. Breakfast cereal, 29 wins, zero losses. Magicians, Connor McGregor. We got a retro series Forrest Griffin, press proof. He is all over this product. And I just rounded off with some base cards here. So it's pretty cool. We got Octagon Royalty Francis and Ganu as our mem card. Not bad. Not bad. I really hope we see him back in the Octagon. He's trying he's trying to fight um what's his name? Tyson Fury. I get it. He wants a payday. I, I hope he doesn't think he's going to win that fight or if he's got coaches that are telling him he could win that fight, then he's in dangerous company. He is in very dangerous company. You got yes men like that, but uh, 
I think he just wants the payday, it would seem. Fizev, this guy is probably maybe the best rookie of the class. Really good fighter. I'm actually just going to throw a sleeve on him. Because why not? So, there we go. Fizev. Here, we're on the press proofs now. Shogun. Gillespie. Bryce Mitchell. Great fighter. And we got Conor McGregor. Bleh. Connor McGregor, Octagon Marvels, and a Crunch Time Dustin Poirier. I wonder if they did that on purpose, putting them next to each other like that. So there we go. Octagon Marvels, Connor McGregor. Um, I feel like, out of respect, I gotta leave Shevchenko up there, champion, and Bisping. Um, Bisping, the card is at least numbered. So Crunch Time, Dustin. Magicians, Shevchenko, Trinaldo, Tim Means. All right, and just the base cards. So, so far, it's okay. I mean, so I put a dent into that $300? I don't know. Probably not yet, but we need a big auto. We need a big auto. That's, got it. That's coming up. The auto is coming up. Get these out of the way. They are nice-looking base cards, I got to say. But yeah, of course, I'm opening them all upside down. I guarantee you I switch, and then it'll go back to being upside down. Nope. Carol Rosa. Here we go. Brian Ortega, press proof. Li Zhang Lang, press proof, rated rookie. You know, he just got smoked. We got Nate Diaz, press proof. We got Kumaru Usman, probably the best fighter in the world right now. Ooh, there's something big in this next one. I don't know what this is. We got duos, Yoana and Zhang Wai Li. They're actually about to fight again. What a first contest that was. Probably the greatest women's fight ever. Arguably the best fight ever, period. And look at that. Zhang Wai Li again. Octagon Marvel's Zhang Wai Li. And just some base cards. So haven't hit that auto yet. Got a lot of cards in this box. Holy crap. I gotta I gotta pick up the pace here. It's gonna lose everyone's attention. So let's get these out of the way. Get these uh base cards out of the way. There's no need to look at those. Billy Quarantillo, pretty good fighter. Press proof, Michael Chandler. What a knockout! One of the greatest knockouts ever. We got Vivian Arajau to 99, really cool, really, really cool uh, parallel here. Sort of like a sunburst, I think that's what it's called. But uh, yeah, so nice press proof there. We got Prohaska, Craftsman, probably the next champ. We got Production Line, Adesanya. That's a cool insert. And the former champ, Amanda Nunez, who could be champ again. And base cards, base cards, base cards, a lot of base cards. So we should be about, I think maybe halfway. We got five left here. Still waiting on that autograph. Still waiting on that autograph. Get these out of the way. Voices of the Octagon, John Anik. Cool little insert. I don't know why. Oh, this is a nice hit. Press proof. Fizev. Raphael Fizev. Nice press proof, not bad. If you're wondering what these cards are worth, like always, I do at the end, I go on eBay and I find that out myself. So crunch time, Amanda. Duos, John Jones, Gustafson. Craftsman, press proof, Khabib. It's nice, I think I could sleeve that up too. Why not? Press proof, Craftsman. And the base cards. So still waiting on that auto, still waiting on that auto. The auto is what is going to be make or break, it's looking like. But I am curious what that what that uh, Nganu card is worth, because that is pretty cool. Tony, Voices of the Octagon, Michael Bisping with his lazy fake eye. Press Proof, Quarantillo. Another Bisping. This is the Bisping box. And we got 
Ryan Spann to 99, and Max Holloway Craftsman. I do like sleeving these numbered cards. Don't really know. Or Ryan Spann, eh, he's okay. He is okay. Max Holloway Craftsman Retro Series. Ooh, we got a gold. We got gold here. High stakes, high stakes. Gold. Let's see, can we get the uh, Ryan Hall gold? Ryan Hall to 10. Wow. Whew, that is the lowest number card I've ever gotten on this channel. It's a shame it's someone like Ryan Hall. Probably has no fans left. One of the most strange fighters ever. But it is to 10, so that's pretty cool. You know what? I'm sorry. Sorry, Chev. But a gold to 10? Wish it was a better fighter, but I mean, hey, number to 10, someone, someone will buy that for sure. Someone will be all over that. So three left. Still no autograph. Says we one auto on average. Hopefully we don't get paninied and we get an auto. Oh, we actually have a redemption. Oh my goodness. Let me take this Shogun card, flip this around so we could, uh, we have a redemption. I'm still waiting on my LaMelo redemption. It's been five months. So we got UFC. Oh my goodness. Redemption. Rated rookie signatures. Ooh. Ooh, number 208, Li Zhang Lang. Are you kidding me? Ah. Uh, Li Zhang Lang. They got me all excited for Li Zhang Lang. Ugh. Nasty guys. Just, just heartbreaking. Tapuria, Derek Brunson. I'll see that card in maybe a year or two. But uh, Nate Diaz, Octagon Marvels. It's like, I just feel like I just got punched in the gut, literally. You know, just feel like I just got punched in the gut. This was a great fight. Ortega, Volkanovsky, Tuivasa. It's like you could physically feel the people clicking off the video after that. But we've got two packs left. Oh, that was heartbreaking. That was heartbreaking. I can't lie. Can't lie, my friends. Rodrigo Bontorin. I mean, you could feel it in my voice. I I just... Uh, ooh, this is pretty cool. Tapuria to 49. That's a nice card. True Blue rated rookie. Tapuria. That's nice. That's actually not bad. Not bad. Uh, take Bisping off here. So that's really cool, that blue. We got Craftsman, Whitaker, Brock Lesnar, one of my favorites to watch in the Octagon. I got to say, we got Stipe, Daniel Cormier. Of all the guys like that I get excited to watch, Like th there's just a feeling when Brock Lesnar was fighting where it's just so unpredictable, and you know Brock is going in there to just to to kill or be killed. And he's just a freak athletic specimen. Like watching his Shane Carwin fights and the Mir fights. Like there was no one that got me more excited than Brock Lesnar when he stepped into it. Oh look at that. It's Li Zhang Lang again. Why couldn't you just sign cards, bro? Why couldn't you just sign the cards? Why do you gotta make us suffer like that? Oliveira. Josh Emmett to 75. Sleeve that one up. Josh Emmett to 75. We got Craftsman Stipe. Francis and Ganu production line. Max Holloway, Octagon Marvels. And a bunch of base cards. So, oh my God, you guys, what a roller coaster it has been. The auto. The Li Zhang Lang Redemption. Gross. So I'm going to go on eBay, look up what some of these big pulls go for, if I could find them. And I'm going to upload this video. Thank you all so much for watching. For more good breaks, 
hobby boxes, everything, every subscription matters. The more subs, the more money I want to dedicate to this channel. So thank you all so much for watching. DGen Rips, I'm out. Go, bro.